for today's uh, video, we're going to upgrade an HP laptop. I'll just put the description below for the model because I couldn't memorize it. Okay, so this was brought by my sister-in-law to help her out with the SSD upgrade and the memory upgrade. So let's take it on. So in the previous videos, we started upgrading some, or my previous laptop, which is the Lenovo X270. If you haven't seen that, I'll just put the description link somewhere. And recently, my sister-in-law brought her old laptop, which is an HP... I forgot what's the particular model of this laptop, but then it's quite an old laptop. You will know when a laptop is quite old when it still has some, uh, CD drives or DVD ROM drives, right? So we already know that upgrading your old laptop especially if it's running from a hard disk drive and upgrading it to a solid state drive it will usually boost its performance aside from that this old laptop only having a 2 gigabit uh, memory so we'll also try to upgrade the memory to at least uh, 16 gigabits of memory so we'll be using this uh, crucial memory module which is uh, dual uh, 8 gig memory and for the hard disk drive we'll be replacing this with a Hikvision SSD E100 which is a 512 gigabit storage so let's start with the disassembly so for this we'll still be using our friendly neighborhood precision screw driver set so as stayed as on the previous videos we this is really a very helpful tool So we'll be using holder, some pry tool, just pull out this one, and the Phillips screw head. We'll be using this one. So let's start from the bottom of this. First and foremost, let's remove the battery. Okay, battery removed. Set it aside and we'll be removing all screws in here.
we are only removing this one so let's try to clean them up while it's here be right back okay so now that it's done cleaning it's time to reassemble Assembly. Let's start on the far side of the case. Okay. So let's try to turn on the laptop and check on the BIOS. Total memory, it's already 16 gigabit, gigabyte. So it's now upgraded to a faster memory. So it's time to install Windows. Just save this configuration and install Windows later. After setting up Windows and driver updates, let us check for the first time boot up of the system. So it has boot up up to 13 seconds, so quite as fast as what we have expected. So again, we have successfully upgraded yet another laptop from an old hard disk drive to a new SSD drive with the 16 gigabit memory upgrade. So if this video is helpful for you, just give it a like and share it with your friends. Till the next video.